<laughs> right this day down in history, Shannon is making a salad. With a whole pack of bacon in it. <laughs> With a whole pack of bacon, so don't worry. It's, yeah. not, it's not your typical not healthy, healthy salad. We're making a yummy, you call it 24-hour salad? Yes. And I've never even heard of this, so I have a lot to learn today. I'm yeah. excited. Super good. Okay, well, what do we need to make our 24-hour salad? Sounds like a lot, but it's not. You need three hearts of romaine, one bag of frozen peas, a third cup grated Parmesan, one bunch of green onions, a third cup of grated mozzarella, a package of bacon. Mm-hmm, whole thing. Six eggs boiled, two cups of mayonnaise, three tablespoons of sugar, a half tablespoon of salt and a half tablespoon of pepper. It sounds like it feeds a lot. It does. It's a good, I want to do it for 4th of July. Okay. It's a great Excellent. thing to go ahead and make and then take. Okay. So. Well, perfect. Well, mm -hmm. when we come back, we're going to put together our 24 hour mm -hmm. salad. And, you know, we have that magic TV oven and our 24 hours will go by yes. like that. <laughs> Stick around. Well, mm -hmm. come back. We are cooking with the W and Shannon is making a salad. Write it down. But yeah. it's not a, it's not your typical not healthy healthy. salad. It's twenty four hour good. salad. Yeah, it is good. It's yeah. nice and refreshing and light for the hot summertime days, right? Oh yeah. Th okay. This is something usually if we have a picnic or barbecue, mm -hmm. I always bring this okay. because you make it the day before, stick it in the fridge. The day of, all you have to worry about is getting ready, getting the kids ready, and getting out the door. Hence the name twenty four hours, yeah. right? So, okay. Actually, so you've got your time. romaine heart. What, yeah. what were you saying? It's okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> It's okay. okay. I've already chopped two romaine hearts, okay. but I want to show with the third one exactly how okay. to do it. I forgot my cutting boards. So we're cutting on a clean tea towel. So all you okay. do is take and you're going to cut it kind of in quarters, but don't cut through the, the root. Okay, so cut close to the bottom, but cut not through. all you the way You want to cut bottom. all the way through, but not all the way through okay. to the bottom. It's going to hold it together like a pom-pom. Got almost. it. And then you'll do it again. And then one more time. Okay. And so this way, when we chop it, it'll already be in small bits. Okay. You don't want to give people really long ribbons of lettuce. Mm -hmm. It's hard, to, especially you know when you put your fork in it, it and it's so big, you can't get it in your mouth, and yeah, kind of like pasta, mm -hmm. lettuce pasta. Yeah, you don't want lettuce so convenient. ribbons. Here, a snack. Mm, you. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> Yummy. So this Bill is a rabbit today. <laughs> you need a really large bowl. Okay. And so we're going to layer this. This is the first one. This is a good little bite size, the lettuce is now. Yeah, so now you just have your little bites. Okay. You really ate it. He Yay. really is a rabbit. <laughs> so our next one, this is our frozen peas. Don't thaw them out. Okay, keep them frozen. Keep them frozen, and this is a 16 ounce package. Mm hmm. Just plain green peas. Plain old frozen fresh All green right. peas. Perfect. Keep those. And the next thing we're going to That's very pretty. It, it gets me. If you have a big clear bowl, it's mm -hmm. gorgeous. Okay. But I don't have one. I've got to get one. This we'll get is you our one. third a cup of Parmesan. Okay. And this is just the grated. It's in the uh, same section with all the other pre-grated. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. You can get your own and grate it, but I get pre-grated. Right. It's easy. Next, this is one bunch of green onions I've okay. thinly sliced. And this will give us an, a nice little kick to it. Do you oh, use the, the whites way. in this too or just the greens? I don't use whites. It's okay. up to you. If you like that really hard mm -hmm. oniony kick, go ahead and use it. I don't it. usually use whites either. They're a little too oniony. I, I usually stick them in the garden. I feel good when they grow and I never use them. <laughs> I'm like, oh, look what I grew. Oh, look what I forgot I grew. So this is a 30 cup of mozzarella. Okay. And we're going to do this on top. Double cheese, Bill. You see that? I know. If Good you want this to cheese. be healthy, you probably should have stopped at peas <laughs> and just had a nice lettuce pea salad. Oh, well. But this is a really good crowd pleaser, too. I think we just heard a boo from the audience. <laughs> Next, okay. this is a half dozen eggs mm -hmm. I boiled and chopped up. Okay. Boiled and chopped boiled eggs. Boiled and chopped. And I do a soft Yum. boil on, on mine if you want to do a hard boil. The only thing, if you overcook your eggs, they turn mm -hmm. green. Ooh. And try not to overcook your eggs because nothing's ugly. You're going to... Then green, green eggs. eggs. Unless you have ham to go Unless with it. Unless you have ham. Right. Which... We have bacon. <laughs> Close. Uh, Same pig. animal. Pig is pig. <laughs> all right. This is an entire package of bacon. Okay. You diced it all up. I fried did. it in a pan. What I did while last night while I was chopping things, I went ahead and I had the bacon cooking in the oven. Okay. The eggs boiling on the stove. So it's all kind of done at one time. Okay. And that is it. That's all our layers. Beautiful. I'm going to wipe my hands. And if you'll pass me that mayonnaise. Sure. Actually, you got lots nice. of colors in here too. Yeah, yeah that's pretty why yellow if you had and the green clear and bowl, white. It would mm -hmm. look really, really pretty. But either way, we're going to mix it up anyway. We're not okay. going to serve it layered. So for our dressing, mm -hmm. this is my salt and pepper. Now I'm using the white pepper just because it looks a little nicer. Okay. You don't have to at same flavor. Use black pepper if you need to, and okay. then the three tablespoons of sugar. Yum. Just glop down in there. And this is just plain mayonnaise. 
Mm -hmm. You can use reduced fat if you mm -hmm. want. But don't if you're do eating that an entire free. pack of bacon and a half dozen eggs, does Might light well mayonnaise really <laughs> matter? So all we're going to do is stir this up okay. and get it really well mixed. Now the only thing you need to watch with white pepper is it tends to lump. So okay. just make sure you get it really mixed in well. And it makes really nice dressing. Okay. So now we go to the top and we're going to ice it. That's, okay. that's all. We want to seal the entire salad with the dressing. Wonderful. All right. We're going to mix all this up, right? Uh, after 24 hours. Okay. What we're going to do after we, we ice this over, we're going to cover it with plastic mm. wrap and seal it really well. And then 24 hours later, or 12, I've done it as little as 12. Okay. Well, we're going to uh, uh, come back in 24 hours and eat this. Justin? <laughs> this right looks now. delicious. It's very good. And you put it in the fridge for put 24 fridge. hours and then okay. stir it up. 12 to 24. 12, 12 to 24. 24. Okay. And why, why is that, Sharon? Why do you have to? Well, the peas have to thaw out. Oh, okay. Family Let all the flavors marry. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And if you have something even like a larger event go to, get mm -hmm. a head of iceberg lettuce and uh -huh. cut that up and put it as a bottom layer and then build your romaine on top. Mm. I was going to do it today, but I didn't have a bowl big enough. So, <laughs> if you have a very mm. large bowl, that's this something you delicious. can do. This is delicious. Isn't it yummy? This is very good. Well, I really like the dressing. You know, it's surprising too because I can't stand like Miracle Whip or mm -hmm. coleslaw dressing, and this is sugar and mayonnaise, which is mm -hmm. basically what they are. But I like it. Hmm. Yeah. I like it too. So it's always better when you make your own, right? Mm -hmm. uh, everything's better when you make your own. And if you want the recipe, okay. email me at mewcooks at gmail.com. There you go. Awesome. Mm -hmm. Very good. Well, thank you. Mm -hmm. Take a break. Come back with more in just a moment. You're watching WCBI News Sunrise.